Oh man, time is hard. I don't even blame her. This lady is talking about how she's so poor and she don't have any money. So she was forced to steal some pads and that she uh she tried to ask people for money but they wouldn't give her any money. So what can you do? I'm about to with the story. Oh. All right. By the way, some stuff should be free. Like stuff like that should be free and condoms should be free. Uh I went to I've been to Walmart and a lot of time I would see empty uh condom boxes. I'm like, you know, go to the clinic, you know, they give them free. Alright, so let's with this. So embarrassed. I hit an all-time low today, and I'm not proud. We all been there. I had to steal pads. I asked two friends if they could loan me some money for Lady Adams, and they said no. And I didn't want to keep making a fool of myself and keep asking people. So I stopped asking and decided to risk it all. Now every lad knows I hear I think it's the cops. I know you're thinking, get a job, but I'm trying. I lost my job a few months ago. And I've been trying like heck to get another one. But it hasn't been easy. Shop leaving, I mean shop lifting wasn't my favorite thing. But I needed pads and nobody will help me. And I'm no fan of uh, free bleeding. What you guys think about this story? What the comments saying? Plain Parenthood can help. Okay, so th those are for people who need, you know, homeless people out there or people, who, you know, who's ladies um, who don't have money to buy pets. This could help you. So Plain par Parenthood can help. And I also know the clinic. I don't know if the clinic does that uh, or a woman clinic, but I know they like give condoms and stuff. A local hospital help them in all the public restroom. When my grandma had a girl, they didn't have pads or tampons. When my grandma was a girl, they didn't have pads or tampons. Back in the 1900s, she told me that we use all fennel. Cut off the... See, this is... this. I'm not even comfortable reading this. This is this is for you ladies. Uh, cut off the arm. Cut off the arm from an old south. Oh, flannel shirt, cut off the curve, cut it, cut it up the side, the long way into rectangle, cut into four equal long rectangles, stack them with a pattern side up. The pattern side is softer and more absorbent. Put a stitch at the eye. All right, all right, all right. All right, so this is how you can make a pad from scratch. They used to wash them and hang them outside the line to to a boy. Woman or woman. Somebody said you could check with the local library. Our library has free hygiene products and chairs near the front. But Chick fil A had pads in the western and the basket for people who needed them. Wow. Don't worry about it too much. You were up against it and did something you didn't want to do. As far as jobs go, Schwar, all the um, small retail stores in your area, if you have not well, in my experience, the ton of those jobs are high enough. You should be able to find something in a few weeks. Yeah, Planned Parenthood, period.org. Right. So this is for the ladies. Ladies, have you ever had to steal pads? Gentlemen, are you the one stealing condoms? Or ladies, are you the one stealing condoms? Condoms are free in clinics, right? Still condoms. So yeah, I saw that. I thought somebody might um, 
benefit from that story it's worth out there it really is don't steal